What's going on you guys? It's George. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another Tommy Hilfiger haul. In today's video, I have two bags worth of Tommy Hilfiger goodies that I cannot wait to share with you. There's brand new and vintage pieces in both of these bags. And let me tell you, there are staples for summer 2021. I have stuff in here that if you don't have these in your collection for this summer, then you're crazy. No, I'm kidding. But um, really, there's some stuff in here that is very cool, very trendy, and I'm super excited to not only share these with you, but bring awareness to some really cool stuff that I found online as well. So if you're interested in today's Tommy experience, then keep on watching. There's a lot to share here, so I'm gonna try to make this haul as quick and as fun as possible. Before we go any further though, if you're not already, please subscribe to my channel. I would love your company. I talk all things Tommy on here. I also have a Tommy Hilfiger appreciation page known as the House of Hilfiger on Instagram, so give that a follow as well. That'll be linked in the description down below. I have a playlist on here of all my Tommy videos, hours worth of content, so do not forget to check that out as well. Again, if you're a Tommy Hilfiger lover, you're gonna love this channel. So we're gonna start off with the brand new pieces. And yes, I actually put the vintage stuff in a uh, Tommy Hilfiger bag as well. We gotta set the mood, guys. Also, I need to make the thumbnail interesting, so uh, <laughs> that is clickbait. I'm normally not really good at that, so I tried. Now, in this is some really cool stuff, guys, that I feel like is gonna be a necessity for summer 2021. One of those pieces being an accessory. Now, I'm sharing this right off the bat because I'm super excited about this. This is a bucket hat, but not just any bucket hat. It is a cargo bucket hat. Cargo, like cargo shorts. I hope they never come back in style because <laughs> no. You will never catch me wearing a pair of cargo shorts ever, ever. Maybe the cargo pants, perhaps. I don't think I'd mind that, but the shorts, guys, I like my shorts to be a little bit more skimpy, a little bit more sultry than um, the cargo shorts, not gonna lie. So this, this is a cargo khaki bucket hat. Love it. I'm obsessed with this, guys. This is the only one in stock at my local Tommy Hilfiger. It is a beautiful piece. We have the Tommy logo right in the fronts, and it's not reversible, unfortunately. I was kind of hoping it was reversible, but that's what it looks like on the inside. We have the Tommy Hilfiger tag. This was originally $34.99, and I got it for 20% off using the Hilfiger Club discount, which is free for everyone, by the way. This is a size SM, so maybe this is a small medium. I'm gonna try this on. I should have tried it on the store, but I didn't wanna like test them because you know, like everything's going on. Let's see. How do we feel about this, you guys? Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. It's a mirror right here. I don't know how it's looking with my hair like this, but it's, it's cute. This is cute. This is a number. This is, this is a moment. I'm not gonna lie. I'm liking it. Is it just me or is this actually kind of a mood? I don't know, but I'm feeling it. So um, bucket hats, you guys, are something that I said I would never wear. Just like how I just said about cargo shorts. Um, so who knows? Who knows? What never say never, I guess. Justin Bieber was right. Never say never. Here I am over here. But um, yeah, I'm feeling this, guys. And uh, it's snug. But again, my head is... My head. My head <laughs> is... Uh, I never had complaints, but it is small. It's definitely, I don't have a big head um, anymore. My hair is definitely not anywhere near as large as it used to be, so I can fit in a small, medium hat. By the way, as a total, I have four items that are brand new in this bag. I spent too much money. Um, I'm not on Tommy Hilfiger's payroll just yet. As much as you may think that I am, I'm not. Not even an ambassador. They have never even shared one of my photos on their Instagram. I don't know what's going on with that. Tommy Hilfiger's marketing and social media team. Do you want to work with people to actually appreciate your brand? Like, come, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna stop. So. But um, yeah, I spent $80.39 for four pieces. Not too bad, because again, these are like staple pieces that you can wear over and over again. So like the bucket hat, you can wear that often. Next, I have a t-shirt and you guys, I just love this color green, this emerald green. This was actually very cheap. Um, so it's Tommy jeans on there. I got a size large because I like my t-shirts to be a little bit bigger. And uh, yeah, it's very simple. Tommy jeans in the front, nothing on the back, but this is just a good piece to, to have guys. And those lazy days where you don't want to wear a polo or a button down, you can just throw on a t-shirt, nice pair of jeans or chinos and cool pair of shoes. You're out the door. Maybe a few accessories here and there. 
You know, I'm the accessory king. I have this vintage Tommy Hilfiger watch going on right now. I have these uh, Tommy Hilfiger necklaces, by the way. I didn't share this video yet, but this is a vintage Tommy Hilfiger necklace with stars and this Tommy Pearl necklace, which I live for. I wear, the, wear that all the time. But uh, yeah, that's like, that's a mood. We love that t-shirt. Now we also got this one right here. This one was new, so I didn't get that much of a discount on this one besides the 20. But it's, it's this beautiful color, you guys. I love anything with this caramel beige color. I don't know what it is about it, but I feel like more in the summer, hopefully I get this color um, skin wise and it will just be like a nice illusion. But it says Tommy jeans, Tommy logo colors, nothing is on the back. And of course we have the Tommy Hilfiger logo right in the sleeve. I just wish that Tommy's tees were a little bit more fitted um, for the people like me. Um, you know, I have decent arms, not to toot me on horn, but they're not bad. But um, these are for, I mean, this is a large shirt, but even the medium, the sleeves are, are bigger. So they need to work on uh, construction a little bit when it comes to their fit and their form for their, their clothing. But I love this, I love it so much. Color, the color is what, what sold me. So two t-shirts, one last piece that is brand new here from the Tommy store, and this. So I have a look in mind, guys. You'll be seeing this a lot on my Instagram and on me throughout the entire summer. I have these Tommy Hilfiger tank tops. They're just the regular white waffled tank tops. And um, I got a size small because I like them to be snug and fit well. And I actually, hopefully they fit. So it's 34, 36 is the small. And I'm just, I plan on just wearing this and like a nice pair of jeans and a button down like this open. So this is actually a vintage Tommy Hilfiger button down, as you can see the crest right there. These are expensive. This is $39.50 for a three pack. I cannot find any Tommy tank tops at Marshalls, TJ Maxx, Burlington. Um, Macy's did have them, but they were the same price and you can't get the Tommy code or Tommy discount off of them. So that's why I just sucked it up and went to Tommy and actually got these. So in my opinion, it's gonna be worth it. There's three of them there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it happen. So not too bad. Now I do have one more brand new piece. This is from a website called Belk. I've never heard of them before, but as I started shopping for my bedroom, I'm doing my bedroom Tommy Hilfiger style, I came across a website that had a lot of Tommy throw pillows. Of course, I picked up a few, which I'll be sharing during my Tommy uh, bedding video soon. But this, this is a belt, and it was totally not my size online, but it was on sale, and the buckle on it is just something I fell in love with. Hopefully it's as beautiful in person as it was online. Oh yeah, this is huge. Oh my god. Are you guys seeing that buckle? Yeah, it is beautiful. So it's a Tommy Hilfiger crest. It says MCMLXXXV Tommy Hilfiger TH. We have the lions, we have a crest, we have a crown. This is beautiful. This, so this is actually um, a $52 belt that I got for 20 bucks. Not bad at all. And it's one of those where like the holes are in there. This is most definitely not gonna fit me. Let me even try to give this a shot right now. Oh yeah, oh my gosh, you guys, look at this. So I would be like right here and the holes are all the way over there. Normally I'm like a size 30 waist, <laughs> lest I know really fast metabolism over here. So it's a struggle trying to gain a pound and in the men's community, guys, let me just tell you, like, being a skinny man growing up was never easy. So, um, as much as you might think it's, like, an amazing, like, blessing, like, I was always picked on for being super skinny. Um, little TMI right there, but, yeah, this belt, I'm gonna have to take off this and work with it somehow. Or maybe I could just, I'll do something. I'm, I'm pretty, I'm pretty crafty when it comes to things that don't fit me, like, adjusting necklaces and stuff. So I'm gonna make this work. The crest though, the crest buckle, that is what sold me. And this is a beautiful, beautiful freaking piece. That's what it looks like right there, by the way, just in case you wanted to see the tag. Um, black style, color, nothing crazy on there, but it does say XL. Moving on to the vintage pieces, you guys. I'm super excited to share these because summer 2021 would not be a summer without a tank top. You gotta show off those arms, right? So aside from the white waffle tank tops, I had a really cool one here that I shared on the House of Hilfiger Instagram page. I did a little poll to see your opinions about it. And um, I got it. So it is this cut off tee. It is Tommy jeans. This is a little short now that I'm looking at it. 
So that's the T, well the, the tank. <laughs> this is the Tommy Jeans tag right there. Something really cool as well, right on the very back it says Tommy Jeans. It's a little faded, but again, this is something that is vintage and that's gonna be really cool just like add to your wardrobe. And even if this is a little short, I'm gonna make it work because I feel like fashion right now is like very fluid and fun. So if it's a little mini on me, I'm not gonna complain because this is a really cool piece. The next piece is one of my favorites from this entire haul. You guys, I was shook when I seen this for the price. This is a Tommy Hilfiger t-shirt jersey. So it's a cotton shirt and it's Tommy jeans. It actually still has the original tag on it as well. So this actually went for $29.99, values for $49.50. Not sure where this was sold at, but that's the authentic original tag. It is, it is a bit dingy as you can see. The, the white is not that white, but I just love the, the whole vibe of this, you guys. Tommy jeans right on the front, the orange, the navy blue. I love the collar and it's V-neck as well, which is kind of cool. I also love how these sleeves are cuffed, just like the collar. And we have this exact same stripe that's in the front right around the sleeves as well. So this is a little oversized, but it's definitely an amazing piece. I don't know how I could possibly like get this to not be dingy. I don't know how it's gonna happen. I may just wear this anyway. I mean, it's you could tell it's like an authentic vintage piece. And I'm not mad. I'm not mad that it's that dingy. I just wish I could make it a little bit more white. If you have any advice, sign off in the comment section down below. Um, this is 85 right there on the heart, if I didn't say that before. And yeah, this is really sick, you guys. What's weird is it says Tommy Jeans, but the tag does say Tommy Hilfiger. Also on the tag, it does say $5. I got this for five freaking dollars. You guys, that is a steal. That's insane. And I'm super pumped to be adding this to my collection. And I will be wearing this this summer. So that's kind of like a laid back fun look. And you know, you can spice it up a little bit with some really cool accessories and whatnot, like I will be doing. So keep an eye out for that. We have one last piece, so let me share this with you really quick. We have something I got from the Salvation Army. Sally's Boutique, you may or may not have heard of it. This is uh, a button down. Now a button down, as you probably are thinking, they're not for the summer, what are you talking about? Like I said, I wanna wear a tank top and a button down over that. That's one of the looks for the evening, or perhaps during the day, if it's a chilly summer day. But this color, it's like this beigey, yellowy color. This is a Tommy jeans. So it's kind of like what I was talking about. Like this shirt says Tommy jeans on it, but the tag says Tommy Hilfiger. So that's a little weird, but I'm not, it's whatever. So this is a Tommy jeans button down. It's open, but that's the pocket on one side. There is like red stitching in certain places, like right here. And on this side, we have a really weird pocket. Like it's slanted and there's no button on it. There's a little space right here. I'm thinking that's for like a pen or something for a student, for an architect. I don't know if the heck's gonna wear this, but I'm gonna wear it. And uh, yeah, it's like a very weird characteristic about this shirt. So we have some red stitching as well. Also on the button part right up here is red stitching. It does say Tommy Jeans, established 1985 right there, there's a little logo. And on the bottom, it is lined in that red stitching like right around the entire bottom. So details like this go such a long way for me when it comes to fashion and I'm absolutely obsessed. I do, I actually have one more piece. This is not fashion related, but this is Tommy Hilfiger vintage related. One of my friends gave me a Tommy Hilfiger. This is a beach mat. So I'm super obsessed. I actually have not seen this yet opened. I've just seen it looking like this. Um, this is insane. Uh, it says Tommy Hilfiger on the buttons right here. Tommy logos right there. And it has all the variations of the Tom Hill figure colors, red, white, blue. And I'm not sure how old this piece is, but I'm in love. I'm so in love with this. Let me get this open and let's see how this looks. Are you guys ready? So that is one side. It is solid red. Looks like it's a nylon material. Oh my God. Stop. Are you kidding me? Tommy Hilfiger pillow, and then this is what the, the front side is gonna look like. And of course, they have the buttons that say Tommy Hilfiger. This is in mint condition. This is minty. I'm in love. Jeff, thank you so much for this piece. This is amazing. 
I've been looking for something like this online, mainly eBay because Tommy has not made anything like this in a very long time. But uh, they're expensive and not in the greatest condition. So this, this is a treasure and I am super, super excited. Of course, you guys will be seeing me rock this a lot this summer as well as taking lots of photos and stuff in it. So amazing. That is a wrap. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me during this Tommy Hilfiger summer 2021 haul. Of course, I'm not done shopping for Tommy Hilfiger pieces for the summer. There are a few things that I've been eyeing up that I absolutely need, such as slides. So if you do find any unique Tommy Hilfiger slides online or in any stores, please let me know. DM me on the House of Hilfiger or just sign off in the comment section. Plus, you guys, thank you so much again for your time, for hanging out with me. If you have not already, please subscribe to my channel. I would absolutely love your company. Join this Tommy Hilfiger family and stay tuned for more Tommy Hilfiger content. Until next time, say thanks, give compliments, and think positive. And I'll catch you in the next video. Bye, guys.